Uh, welcome to yet another wrestling channel. My name is Rich, and uh, this is just going to be a little short video because uh, I haven't done one this week. I was doing them every day for the past two weeks, and I just want to keep going. And this is just going to be a little sort of nerdy story. And if you're a proper wrestling nerd, you know that obsesses over little details like me, you might enjoy this. I don't know. Uh, but on the network or Peacock or whatever you have, we still have the network here. Uh, if you watch WCW Nitro from January 25th of 1999, uh, there's a match somewhere in the middle of that show uh, with Scott Hall against Bam Bam Bigelow in a ladder match, which sounds like it'll be disastrous, but it's actually not that bad. Uh, there's a, a, like a three-way feud going on at the time between those two and Goldberg. And... It all stems from Goldberg's streak ending and Scott Hall using the cattle prod and then uh, the finger poke of doom and the NWO being a thing again. and uh, Yeah, all, all kinds of sort of big things in WCW around that time. This is kind of the start of the decline, a lot of people say. But anyway, when you watch that match, so I it was a few years ago I noticed this, but on Scott Hall's elbow pad, and there should be a picture down there, uh, you can see like a purple underlining and it's all I could see once I'd noticed it you know and you notice something and you just obsess on that detail and as I kept looking and I think the screenshot caught it you can just about see the yellow underneath of his old Razor Ramon logo so he was wearing his Razor Ramon gear on Nitro, which I said this wasn't going to blow anybody's mind, it's just a little nerdy thing that I spotted uh, as I was watching that one day. And I can't prove this because the Twitter account I was using at the time is, is gone, uh, and this is quite a few years ago, and probably the seventh or eighth time I gave up tw on Twitter. I just threw a tweet out about it, and to my shock, about half an hour later, I got a reply from Scott Hall himself. An AEW wrestler that shall remain nameless, <laughs> uh, once replied to me and I hadn't even tagged him. So we know he Googles himself. <laughs> um, but I tend not to sort of interact with wrestlers. So it was, it was, quite, a, so it was quite a surprise to get a, a reply from the man himself, especially, you know, a legend like Scott Hall. And he said words to the effect of, and this is almost an exact quote, that shows you where I wanted to be, brother. <laughs> so, uh, I mean, 99 wasn't a great year for him, uh, personally. He was off TV for a lot of that year. It just shows, you know, uh, how unhappy he was in WCW at the time, and, you know, that's just a little nod to the fans that he'd rather be back over in the WWF, and it had taken another three years for him to get back there. Uh, in 2002 uh, with the NWO so yeah that's uh, just a little nerdy wrestling story there uh, just wanted to do a video because uh, I haven't done one this week uh, thank you if you watched uh, I hope you enjoyed it if you did uh, please comment like subscribe all those stuff I meant to ask you to do and yeah I'll be back with uh, hopefully something a bit more substantial maybe double or nothing themed uh, quite soon so thank you